Take one, <laughs> all right, we ready? All right. All right. Y'all keep in mind, we've already all seen this. Wait, so. wait. What? I'm just kidding. No. no. <laughs> all right. Here we go. Right. We got a big delivery all the way from Fight Whoa, Jordy. There you go. All the way from five star. Is this going to the dome? Any of this stuff Don't needed? It. Oh, There's boy. Pieces in there. We can bring with it. Oh, uh, it's right on time then, because right. we're about to be loading up and getting ready to go. There we go. Are these fiberglass hoods? I don't know if we need to take a fiberglass hood brand new to the dome. <laughs> I do know what we're going to need at the dome. We're probably going to need plenty of those. <laughs> and plenty of these. What is that? Oh, is that bracing? Bracing. <laughs> Just throw it all in the truck. All right, we are getting ready for our last event of 2024. We're going to the dome for the Gateway Dirt Nationals. We'll be leaving first thing in the morning. Got to get loaded. It's Monday. Be leaving first thing Tuesday, tomorrow morning. Driving the 11 or so hours to St. Louis, the Dome at America Center for the Gateway Dirt Nationals. Our first time going, super excited about that. But today we gotta get everything loaded up and get ready to pull out of here in the morning. And more importantly, show y'all what we've been uh, working on for our wrap for the Dome. Is that electric? E-bikes. Yeah, they say we, we can't take our four-wheeler. No, e-bikes or scooters. Okay, well. You got your scooter? I got it charging. <laughs> How do you go dig up the charger? I got the mounts for a push bar on it already. Oh, yeah, I got to put the push bar, bar on it. <laughs> I mean, you know, if you're going downhill, it might push yeah. it. <laughs> I rode this thing in Charlotte. Uh, Woo! Whoa. Dang. You got the power. <laughs> you have to, sometimes you have to pedal it off, you know. Yeah, give it a little boost. That's your, that's your, um, front right there. <laughs> Check him out. All right, we'll see you up there. See you. We'll see you up there. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Dirt Daddy's excited. Yeah. Speaking of exciting, it is time. It's almost time. We got to get tires on this thing, get it on the ground, and we can get her uncovered, take a good look at it, show y'all what we got here before we get it loaded up. Slide the nose back in. Lots of spare. Lots of spare stuff. I mean, deck pieces we got. All of them. All of them, yeah. <laughs> All right. Got our rear end. Rear end over there? Yeah. Whole spare rear end. Boiler sides. T-bars. We got a spare nose piece. Whole yeah. nose. Can you see it? You said no to Oh, there it is. <laughs> it was hiding. Hey, you're giving me anxiety like <laughs> Where is it? It was just right here. <laughs> yeah, it's right there. It was snake. It would have bit me. <laughs> it's like, anybody seen my glasses? Yeah. <laughs> you were. That bracing is what was in our special delivery earlier from Five Star. Good stuff. Yeah. You see it? Thick, strong. Yeah, give a little but not break. Tops over there. Four string fenders. <laughs> We got the depth. <laughs> <laughs> I put those fenders up against anybody. <laughs> I think you go to this track prepared for anything. Speaking of prepared, this is just about prepared to show y'all to pull the cover back. And almost. almost. Hey, but first, we got another thing. We're making them wait even longer. We are taking ever bent old body part we got. We're taking every body part we got. The ones that are usable are going in the grass cart. The ones we're done with will be in the vendor tent if somebody wants a nice something to hang in the man cave. There you go. All right, this is our Eldora body along with every other uh body piece we're no longer going to be using it'll be in the vendor area you can buy this and use it yeah yeah that's how nice it is. or put it on your wall <laughs> but we'll be in section 101 is where the ladies will be in the uh the vendor area come find them and get a body panel or t-shirt or hoodie or hat okay are we ready 
<laughs> I guess by ready, I mean ready to put the tires on it. <laughs> All right, yeah, okay, okay. We're gonna get it on the ground first. So a little background info about this wrap. We wanted to do something special for this being a big race and uh, us being able to go up there for the first time. But it is also this season, we have, are finishing up our fifth season of doing the videos here on YouTube. So we wanted to do something special for it being the end of our fifth year as well. <laughs> we missed a deck piece. <laughs> Are we ready? I think so. Hey, I'm ready. If y'all waiting on me, you're backing up. I've been waiting. All right. Which way are we going? This way with it? <laughs> You've been waiting to see it. You're the one that put it on. Wait. <laughs> what? I think it's lunchtime. Take lunch. All right. We ready? All right. All right. Y'all keep in mind, we've already all seen this. Wait. So. Wait. What? I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> all right. Here we go. Here we go. Get our long acre car cover out the road. And there it is. Special dome wrap for Joseph's 10 car. And kind of a special fifth, uh, fifth anniversary deal as well. What we got here is uh, our wrap that we had that Jesse's run here at the end of the year. We took it and traded the gator skin for pictures all from the last five years since we have been doing the YouTube videos here with the race team. Y'all plan on taking that with us? Just in case? Uh, I mean, we'll see how we're looking. <laughs> in case the sprinkler room. system comes on? <laughs> right. Pictures on this side. It is different on each side. So we basically got pictures from the whole five years. Tried to get everybody that's been a part of the team here in the photos and also encompass some of our favorite memories that we made over the last five years. We kind of figure after looking at it, there's a good chance like on the racetrack, it's gonna look like camouflage. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, the know. pictures are more of an up close thing. Right, so right. imagine there's, you know, usually there's a lot of people that wanna come around and take pictures and, mm -hmm. and uh, get there with us, so. If you get your chance to stand stand by this thing, take a picture. I think yeah. it's pretty. If cool. you're at the dome, get a pit pass, come in there, get a close look at it. Might want to come uh, Friday. Yeah, before it hits the track. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the good news is we got a whole nother body. We got two whole sides to go on it, but we got a lot of lot of special moments here. You got the Super B win, the old four cell car, mm -hmm. and then Jesse snuck in there somewhere somehow. It's the Harvey Jones Memorial win at All Tech. We got uh, Eldora. Hey, Jesse's first laps in a late model. Yeah, just when Jesse drove the old Masters built, had 56 on it. A crazy kart race. Somewhere on there is a picture from the box race, the National 100 win. And we swapped motors in the middle of the night at Cochrane. Joseph's ready to give an elbow over here off his right rear quarter panel. Or, I don't know, to give Des Jesse a dent in the face. <laughs> Have we already made the World 100? One of, Jess one of Jesse's last wins. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, honestly, it's so long that's, it's in black and white. that's when Jesse swept uh, swept the 602 division at Magnolia right there. There you are, mate, on the World 100 stage, Joseph. Yeah. Back in the National 100 victory lane. There you are, winning the oh, box yeah, race. That's the box race. That's, that's the box it. race there. I will never do that again. <laughs> <laughs> and we even snuck. There's Dusty. He made it. And we snuck in the uh, the Bristol and then victory. The, uh, Oh yeah, yeah, and la hey, last minute, barely made it, the win at Lay Mullets. Big thank you to everyone on the car, Langenfelder Mechanical Contractors, Base Racing Fuel, Trading Paints, Dirt Track Bank, all the product sponsors here. Really couldn't do it without them, and it's cool that we can go to big events and, uh, and do uh, special things like this that really mean a lot to us. Really awesome when you see these pictures and you think about the memories that we made over the last five years and all the memories that we will make in the years to come. Oh, we doing a droop check. Doing the droop. They ought to have us a concrete stall up there, right? You good? Yeah. You good? Yeah, just barely. We don't want, don't want to be overdoing if it. If you get down here and look up, <laughs> get up here, you know what I mean? If you look dead at it right here, it's 50 and three quarters. Oh, there's also from Bristol. I was wondering, that's us on the Crown Vic. 
at Bristol. I was wondering if that one made it. Oh, it's not too much. No. You know? Mm-hmm. This, uh, this original wrap, this is the same thing, same basic design Jesse has over there. We just replaced the gator skin with the pictures. This original wrap was designed by John Darby, CFM Designs, and then Freestyle Graphics. They do all of our t-shirts, all of our wraps. They took and helped us get the picture collage and all that and printed it for us. So thanks to those guys for helping out with this deal and working with us on it um, because it really was quite the project, picking out these pictures and then getting them on there where they hey, looked like a good collage. Don't forget, we got t-shirts Oh, yeah. And hoodie. Hey, yeah, there you go, Dusty. Good time. All right. All right, we have to go along with the design. We got a special hoodie and t-shirt these will be available at the dome and then they will also they are available on htfmerch.com right now. Right, now. right now they will not ship until we get back though so there's a good chance if you order one of these it will not be there in time for christmas but they are available you can order them right now on our website htfmerch.com and they will definitely be in the booth at the dome there is the front of the shirt as well I kind of like how we made that. That's a movie reel, basically. Yeah. You know what I mean? Circling the car there. So I thought that was pretty Very slick. So for those that haven't been following along, this is Betty, the car that Jesse has been driving most of the year. And we got the trusty old dream that will be running as well it has 65 laps since we had it fresh and jay dickens freshened it up and we got it back jesse ran it at southern twice since we got it back yeah that ain't acting quite right Guess we had a bad coal wire, mm -hmm. or it just decided to crank after we changed them. Oh. Well, dang, Jordy. So we had trouble with it cranking there, obviously. The only thing we did was went and grabbed a coal wire. Yeah, just yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe Jordy just needed to do it. Huh? We did add a little bit more fuel, but I don't think that was mm. really the issue. Maybe she was just really cold. Well, take that coil wire just in case. Yeah, we're take it. <laughs> Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put it right here. <laughs> okay, before we load the car. Hey, Jordy's been working over here. If y'all uh, didn't see our latest video, go check it out. Jordy's got something new in there. I see you've been working. I am. Did you get a body on that thing too? Yeah. Can we show them? Yeah, yeah. We'll just take a little look at the work. So it's only been a couple days since Jordy showed us his new car. And him and... Magnus already got a body just about on it. So, in addition to getting the race car up there, we got to get all this stuff up there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, remember how I said we'll be in section 101? We will have plenty of stuff t shirts, hats, hoodies, mini doors, car cutouts, stickers, koozies, everything you need will be in section 101. This is all the stuff that didn't fit in the cargo trailer. <clears throat> 
So we'll have extras in the front of the cargo in this trailer. Yeah. <laughs> cargo in this trailer, huh? Yeah. Okay, I like it. <laughs> so do the extra t shirts. Yeah, I got forgot it. how to load a race car, huh? Before I forget, I want to let y'all know that Dirt Draft is doing some cool things for the Gateway Dirt Nationals for the Dome Week. Download the Dirt Draft app or go to dirtdraft.com and get signed up to get some cool new things for new subscribers. Sign up for Dirt Draft this week during Dome Week, and this is everything that you will receive. A free Dirt Draft t-shirt, a $50 Deathridge Optics promo code, a $20 My Race Pass All Access promo code, and you'll receive a $10 GotaRace.com promo code. Dirt Draft is fantasy sports for dirt late model racing. Pick five drivers each night during the Dome Week. How they do determines how you do against others that are playing as well. They'll have a, a, a leaderboard, all kinds of cool things going on for the Dome Week. DirtDraft.com or download the Dirt Draft app to get started. Don't skin it up going in. Get a running start, fellas. There you go. Hey, we gotta go back up. I was kind of worried it wouldn't roll with all that weight on it. Oh, man, it's... <laughs> Good thing it's concrete where we're going and not dirt or grass. Oh yeah, perfect fit. Perfect fit, fellas. All right, it took us till dark, but we are loaded up, ready to pull out in the morning and head to the dome gonna be an exciting weekend get over to dirt draft get signed up to compete over there and then don't forget about htfmerch.com for the new shirts tune in on flow to watch the dome live or come see us at the dome gonna be a good weekend thank y'all for watching this video like comment subscribe we'll see y'all later